Sarah Gates and her partner Kale got engaged during stage four, but it's a milestone they marked alone. I would love to know for sure when I'd be able to leave the state and go visit my family. The uncertainty compounded by the fact they don't have access to any of their usual emotional outlets. Having the gym, it was always a sense of community. You could go there, have a social aspect and just a way to blow off steam. Any stress that was going on in your life, you could just have that outlet. Experts say the long stint of isolation is impacting our health. During the first lockdown, calls to Lifeline increased by more than 20%. The longer people are in lockdown and curfew, the greater the loneliness and that in itself is another pandemic we can't allow to get out of control. We have this issue of fear. Fear is a very serious issue for anyone, not just the people who are prone to mental health problems. A fear of catching coronavirus is also stopping Victorians from seeking medical treatment for other ailments. So you have people out there with cancer, with a whole lot of diseases who need attention and they are just not presenting and the lockdown rules make it very difficult. There's also still no word on when elective surgeries will resume since they were put on hold in metropolitan Melbourne back in July. Elective surgery is not a matter that we have finalised yet. It's a very important question. I know there are many people out there who've had to have their surgery cancelled. Yet another casualty of the war on coronavirus.